Once the city used to pulse with energy, dirty and dangerous, but alive and wonderful. Now, it's something else. The changes came slowly at first. Most didn't realize, or didn't care, and accepted them. They chose a comfortable life. Some didn't. And those who refused to conform were pushed to the sidelines, criminalized. They became our clients. We call ourselves runners. We exist on the edge, between the gloss and the reality. The mirror's edge. We keep out of trouble, out of sight, and the cops don't bother us. Runners see the city in a different way. They see the flow. Rooftops become pathways and conduits, possibilities, and routes of escape. The flow is what keeps us running, keeps us alive. Get off that roof, mate. 
Don't care how you do it, just do it. Officer Connors. Going to see Pope. Robert Pope. Taking a statement on that break-in last week? Anyways, it's uh, 56 West Arlen Drive. Tell Lieutenant Miller. Copy that. I'll relay the message, Officer Connors. Thanks. Connors out. Hello, sis. You there, kiddo? Hey, Mark. I bet you're listening to the chatter. You know me. We'll try and get some sleep. It's been a rough day. Gonna put the word out tomorrow. See why those blues got itchy trigger fingers. I'll drop by later, okay? And don't chuck that pizza. I like the top and Matured. Sure. Yeah, I know. See you, Mark. Shots fired. Repeat, shots fired. All units proceed to 56 West Arlen Drive immediately. Proceed with caution. Kate! Where are you? Kate, where are you? Merc. You off? Just get on comms and track me. Almost there. Well, anytime you'd like to tell me where there is and what the hell you're doing, feel free. It's my sister. Ah, uh, okay. I'm gonna see if I can figure out what's going on. Give me a sec. West Arlen, Pope's place. I guess that's where you're headed, but be careful. I'll tell him what's going on there. <gasps> Did you? No! You don't recognize him? Should I? It's Robert. Robert Pope, friend of Dad's. Shit, that Pope. He called me. We hadn't talked much since I joined up. He had a break-in last week. He's still a campaigner. Don't you read the news? It's not news anymore. It's advertising. He was running for mayor. So the break-in must have really spooked him then. That's what I thought. But it was odd. He told me about the break-in, asked me to come, then asked after you. Really? I haven't seen him for at least ten years. Anyway, he was alive when I got here. Just sitting at his desk, writing. Everything went black. When I came to, he'd been shot. And I'm pretty sure it was with my gun. There was a book on the desk. A diary. It was gone. I'm sure there was someone else in the building. Left my radio in the car. Haven't had time to phone it in. Come on. Come with me. I'll take you somewhere safe. This isn't the time to run. I'm not like you. Running will just make me look guilty. You think this was an accident, Kate? There are no accidents in this city. Someone wanted him dead and wanted you to take the fall. Help me, Effie, please. You've got contacts. There's got to be more to this. Something he knew. Something he wanted to tell me. I can't get involved in this, Kate. You know what I do. I just great. can't. Blue's incoming, Faith. You might want to be outgoing right about... Oh, now. I'll see what I can do. If this goes down badly, find Lieutenant Miller. 
My superior. Take anything you find to him. I'm serious, Faith. Remember, they're not playing nice. Get out of there. Now go! And Faith... Thank you. Shit! Get out of that building, Faith. Move! Watch swarming on you, Faith. Find a way out of there.
did good, Faith. No word on what's got the blues so trigger happy, but I'll keep on it. And, uh, don't worry about your sis, okay? We'll fix it. What the hell, Merc? Something's got somebody rattled, kiddo. I don't know what it is, but they're mighty jittery. Hey, Sal. Take long to lose them? Nah, those blues can't move for shit. I've got a little gun happy, though. Wires are fizzing about Pope's murder. Blue traffic is up. Way up. Don't know what's got into them. Must be contract renewal time. Be careful out there, Sal. So why all the heat? Now, a girl's been lifting evidence from a crime scene. Now every cop in the city seems to be after her. That the evidence you lifted? Yeah, I think it's from a diary. Rest of it was gone. All I can make out are Icarus, maybe. And to the highest. Icarus. Wasn't he the Greek guy? Yeah, his dad made him some wings out of feathers and wax. Then the boy flew too close to the sun. And pssst, no more wings, no more Icarus. If anyone's heard anything, then you know who it'll be, Faith. Yeah? I know he ain't a runner anymore, but he's got contacts. You can't avoid him forever. Wanna bet? Who? Jackknife. Drake's got a location on Jackknife. He's on some rooftops at the old runner training ground near the storm drains. Route's crawling with blues, though. City you can follow the canal for the Hampton Town District. Get going.
Those snipers out or keep out of their way. Just get your ass through there. <laughs> Jackknife may know something about Pope's murder, so don't let him wind you up, okay? He used to be a pretty decent runner. God knows who he's working for now.
I know what you're here for, Faithy. Just tell me what Icarus has to do with Pope's murder, Jack. I heard a cop did it. You heard wrong. You a fan of wrestling, Faith? Pope was a wrestling fan. He even employed an ex-wrestler to handle his security. Travis Burfield used to go by the name of Rope Burn. Is this going somewhere? Rope Burn? Well, he's really just a thug who got lucky. And sometimes people are too ignorant to see their place. Always want to swim in the big pond. Never see the bigger fish. If I were you, I'd start with that glorified slab of meat. Happy hunting, Faithy. Listen, I don't know about going to Rope Burn straight away. I'm not. I'm gonna say no. Oh, Faith, what are you doing? You're gonna tell him about Jackknife? Not yet. He's still a cop. No matter what Kate says. Do you see him? Yeah. He's heading for his car. Lieutenant Miller? I'm Faith. Kate's sister? She never mentioned a sister. Yeah, well, we're not the mentioning kind. She told me to find you if things went bad. She's been arrested. And you wouldn't be the suspect seen fleeing from the crime scene, would you? Well now, it's difficult to recall with a gun in my face. I know what you are. You know it was a setup, right? I know Kate wouldn't be capable of something like this. But my captain's asking some difficult questions, and I can't even get in to see her. What do you know about something called Icarus? Why? It's mentioned on this. It was in Pope's hand. I think it's from his diary. You took evidence. Kate's the only family I have, Lieutenant. And Blue's in jail don't last long. She goes down for this? It's a death sentence. I won't stop you. I owe that much to Kate. But there are plenty of people who'll try. And I can't stop them either. You better learn how to run. Running is what I do best. Rope Burns got an office at Sea Burfield International Shipping near the Riding Park subway. Should be a sign on top of the building. It'll help guide you. Look, I saw Rope Burn wrestle once. Broke some poor bastard's arm, then headbutted the ref. So if this Rope Burn really is mixed up with Pope's murder and Kate's setup, then he sure won't be a punk. He'll be a fighter. Bunch. Look, 
Meet me at that new place on Reno Street tomorrow. 4 p.m., okay? Don't freak, they ain't finished building it yet. All quiet once you get above street level. See you there. And don't bring any of your friends. We good? Good. Anyways, I gotta get some chow. Brain like this don't hold up itself, you know. <laughs> did know something, huh? Wonder who he's meeting with. Get back here and we'll find a way to make you an uninvited guest. Hey, look sharp. I'm getting Blue's heading for you. You must have triggered a silent alarm somewhere. Ass out now.
Chopper's got a call from its mom that's bugging out. Not for long, I'll bet. Can you get a message to Miller? I need to see him again. Sure. I received your message. I started looking into Ropeburn. Why? He's Travis Burfield, Pope's head of security. You think he killed Pope? Maybe. He sure as hell set Kate up. Wanted a cop to go down for it, and he wasn't alone. Heard him mention Project Icarus. Burfield is dangerous, Faith. He's not someone you want to mess with. He framed my sister. I'm sorry, Faith. For what? For this. I don't want Kate to go down for this either. But we've got private firms muscling in on our districts. Bolstering city security, they call it. They're breathing down our necks, waiting for us to slip up. The only way they might go easy on us, and easy on Kate, is if I give them... Me. Yes. All I care about is Kate. And for her sake, I'm gonna let you go. But if you pull a gun on me again, I will kill you. And right now, I think I'd be doing the city a favor. There's a bird going in the direction of Roeburn's meeting. You think it's Roeburn's pal? Maybe, but it looked like a CPF one to me. And how many other people can get their paws on a bird in this place? Not many. Hey, you better get going if you want to catch them. You keep off street level two. Blue's around. Yeah. Should never have trusted a blue. He's with Ropeburn. Bet he's up to his neck in this Icarus stuff. I'm heading up. See what I can find out about Pope and Kate.
talk fast. I can see your hands starting to sweat. You set up Kate Connors, didn't you? That little cop? Yeah. Had to be a cop, right? I don't mess with politics. Who killed Pope? You? No! I... I hired someone. Who? A professional. Meeting him tomorrow at 2 p.m. Aching in the mall downtown. You'll recognize him. Why were you with Miller? <laughs> you sure you want to know about that? Pull me up and I'll tell you. Watch him, mate. Try anything in your road game. Someone shoot it. They got rope burn. What the? Who's about to crash the party, babe? Get out of there. about a murderer yeah 
Yeah. Popes. Got a tip off about a meet at the New Eden Mall tomorrow. Gonna pay a visit. Shit, Faith. Why are you doing this? It's not your fight. Just, I don't know, lay low. Everything's changed. The city's different now. I keep thinking of my folks. They thought this place was something worth protecting. Mom and Dad were friends with Pope. Organized protests, lobbied the mayor, took me and Kate on marches. But I never really understood why back then. What it meant. Merck said your mom died. She was killed during the downtown riots. Protest marches that went bad. That's rough. After that, we, uh, well, pretty much fell apart. Dad never forgave himself, and I, well, I left home soon after. Guess I never really forgave him either. That's when you met Merck? He caught me, breaking into his place. No kidding. You never said that. He offered to train me. Felt like a good way off the street, so I took it. Not much else going for me. What you're doing now, Faith, is the fastest way to get yourself killed. They got my sister involved, Cell, and I need to clear her name. I owe her that much. I'll survive. That's what we do. Survival is overrated. You need to live a little, too. Hey, you want to come with me tomorrow? Could use the help. Can't. Drake's got me on a job. Says I've been slacking. Look, I've got to go. It's fine. Someone's bound to start shooting at me soon. Get going. Faith. Take care. Should be ahead of you, but watch it. Mayor Callahan's on some kind of campaign drive about. A few streets away, so there are roadblocks all over the place. Should be a way up onto the overpass in section three and four.
I doubt. You should be able to get into the mall without being shot at. Faithy, nice of you to drop by. With a little bit of persuasion, Ropeburn was pretty chatty. Told me about his meeting with Hope's killer at the mall. And you're thanking me, right? <sighs> but when I got there, guess who was waiting for me? No idea, Faithy. I just go there for the pretzels. Bad case of the blues. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you? No, Faithy! It wasn't me! Besides, if I wanted you dead, don't you think I would have just killed you myself? You're right. A creep like you couldn't have organized it. Now, don't be like that. Ropeburn's dead. I'm impressed. Wasn't me. You need to be careful who you hang around with. Oh, I learned that a long time ago. And yet, here we are again. But I'm afraid I'm gonna have to cut this little meeting short, Faithy. Places to be, you know how it is. Try not to get yourself killed. Merc. Merc, you can stop pretending not to listen now. <laughs> What's up? Can you do a search on Perundella Kruger security? On it. Why do you ask? Been seeing their name around. 
in Rope Burns' office and somewhere else. Distinctive logo. Getting anything? Mm, just what you'd expect. Alarms, fencing, armored cars, private security. Oh, and they secure our world, apparently. Where are they based? A few offices around town. Just got a new place down near the docks. Get me some coordinates. I'm gonna go check it out. Head toward the building with the big stupid dog symbol. Loading bay should be a way in.